Hi there, I'm Jennifer Matatek, Executive Director of AWE Art Windsor Essex, formerly the Art Gallery of Windsor. AWE is delighted to recognize our funding from the Gordie Howe International Bridge Project to support our project in Sandwich titled Look Again Outside Sandwich. We are pleased to bring a number of reproductions from our art collection, which recognize and represent some of the faces, places, and artists that are relevant to our region, specifically this neighborhood. We also look forward to working with a member of the Sandwich community to select the artworks and the locations for the artworks that will really resonate with the people who live and work in this neighborhood. We believe art can inspire change and growth, and we are excited to bring our collection out of our building and into Sandwich. I'm Becky Parent, Executive Director of Big Brothers Big Sisters. This past year, partly with the help of the Community Benefits Program of the Gordie Howe International Bridge Company, we're serving more young people than ever in the neighborhood of Sandwich and in Sandwich schools. Our success, however, has also highlighted the need here, with more applications than ever from those seeking mentorship for their child. In response to that need, in 2022, we're creating a waiting list group mentoring program in Sandwich, a program where children and teens can be mentored in a group setting until they can be matched to their very own big brother or big sister. Mackenzie Hall is our new permanent location for our agency, and Gordie Howe Bridge Company dollars will turn space there from beige to all the colors of the rainbow, from a historical monument to a magical mentoring space with colorful carpets, beanbag chairs, a large screen, and projector for movie nights. Thank you to the Gordie Howe Bridge Company. Your dollars will create a home for sandwich neighborhood youth, a home where they can come after school, meet with safe adults who care about their futures, and get them ready for the life-changing experience that is Big Brothers Big Sisters. Thank you. Hi, my name is John Elliott. I'm the Executive Director of the Sandwich Teen Action Group. I'd first of all like to thank the Bridge in North America, Gordie Howe International Bridge for the funding for some new outdoor basketball hoops. This is going to benefit the youth and the community at large to be able to play basketball outside during the summertime as our kids play basketball. Hi, I'm Dave Leslie, the president for the Society of St. Vincent de Paul in Windsor, Essex. And I'm here with Russ and Darlene Morency, our coordinators for our Caring Heart Food Banks located right here at our society shops there in the West End. Uh, in the next few weeks, we're going to be building a new sidewalk and a protective awning, all thanks to the funding from the we've received from the Windsor Detroit uh, Bridge Authority. We're very grateful for that donation. We serve 75 families on Mondays at the food bank and we're worried that they may fall due to the wet weather. We want to thank everyone. Hello Canada and welcome to Detroit. My name is Herman Jenkins, Trails Manager at Friends of the Rouge. Friends of the Rouge is working with community stakeholders to establish a 29 mile water trail and network of connected greenway trails on the Lower Rouge River. The Rouge River Water Trail is an urban water trail that will span 10 cities from Canton to the confluence of the Rouge and Detroit Rivers, where at the trail's end, you will see the concrete footings of the new Gordie Howe International Bridge rising into the sky. Fort Street Bridge Park opened in spring of 2020 and is Detroit's only access point on the Lower Rouge River. Phase two of the Fort Street Bridge Park multi-purpose trailhead will double the park green space, rebuild the fishing and observation deck, and install a universally accessible kayak launch to create meaningful and equitable access to the greatly restored Rouge River. Friends of the Rouge is using funds from the Gordie Howe Bridge Company Community Benefits Program to complete construction documents and permitting for this project to bring it 100% shovel ready. Friends of the Rouge is truly grateful to receive this award. Thank you. Hi, I'm Christine Bell, and I'm the Executive Director at UNI. And I'm standing in one of the lots that we will transform using the dollars that the Community Investment Fund has given us. We are so excited about this grant. We've been talking with neighbors for the last four months about what they want to see done with vacant land in their neighborhood. And this grant will help us to create more community gathering spaces, places where residents can access fresh food and just enjoy green space. Hi, I'm Don Wilson, president of Lazy Me Duff Bobby. And I'm Dave Gerlich, vice president of Lazy Me Duff Bobby. We'd forgive you for thinking this is the Amazon rainforest, but it's not. We're at 221 Mill next to historic 1798 Duff Bobby Mansion. We are thrilled to be a lucky recipient of a Gordie Howe International Bridge Company Community Organization Investment Grant. 
This year's project is the first phase in reclaiming the overgrown garden space at the mansion. First, we will identify just what plants and trees are in here in order to remove the invasive and non-native plants. Ultimately, this will provide a safer and more accessible green space for the people of Sandwich and the community as a whole. Thanks, Thanks for this very generous grant. My name is Amanda Holliday and I am a member of the Livernois to Clark Block Club. I'm super excited that we got the Gordie Howe Bridge Grant. We are going to do so many cool things in our awesome neighborhood. We get to use this money to have fun events and meetings with neighbors. I'm hoping that this grant will help us to support our neighborhood in the midst of having a new Canada Bridge here. My name is Carmen and I'm a member of the Livernois to Clark Block Club. Hello, my name is Sarah, and I am a member of the Livernois to Clark Block Club, reporting from Southwest Detroit, my home. Uh, I'm really excited that we got this grant to help build out the Block Club. Uh, we've got wonderful leaders in this community, we've got wonderful neighbors, and this grant gives us the opportunity to go the extra mile with some of our programming and events and outreach. And so I'm really excited to see where the organization will be and where our neighborhood will be in the next year as we get things going. So thank you for the opportunity, and excited to work with you all. We are members of the Livernois to Clark Block Club. Thank you so much, Gordy Halbridge.